Hey there, I'm Raj. Welcome back to my channel, 100 Days to ML. In today's video, we are going to look into two more different types of regression, Ridge and Lasso. So let's begin. Okay guys, here we are today with three more regression models. Those are Ridge, Lasso and Lasso Lastic. What is Ridge? Ridge is another linear model where it applies or imposes a penalty over the size of the coefficients. This makes sure that there is less noise in our model and we get more accurate data. So how does it calculate the weight that is required to apply on the coefficients? So for to answer this, scikit-learn has got a rich CV method that is cross validation that applies the model different alpha values alpha parameters and then gets the best alpha value what is lasso lasso is another linear model that estimates spare coefficients why do we need lasso when rich is also doing the same thing however there is similarity between rich and lasso lasso is more effective when there is high number of dimensions that is if we have more independent x values to the lasso what it does is it will find the correlation between each x and y and compares if there is any similarity in that correlation if there is a correlation lasso will neglect the same correlated x parameters and works with smaller x in this way we will get a most efficient algorithm and even to calculate the alpha value in lasso we have got cross validation method okay so what is lasso loss lasso loss is implementing lasso with BIC or base information criteria or AIC attaches information criteria for model selection. What is LAST? LAST stands for least angle regression in which the large model will run the algorithm on different steps and at each step it finds the predictor most correlated with the response that is it will find the most correlated independent value with the dependent value when there are multiple independent values having equal correlation instead of continuing along the same predictor or it continuing along the same x or independent value it will proceed in different equiangular between the x values here i have mentioned few advantages and disadvantages of LAS. so let us quickly begin the code i am here importing the packages that are required the data set that we are going to work on used car sales that we have already been using for regression as we know the dependent variable y is the price an independent variable is other than price i am going to split the data set into two halves one for training and one for validation in the ratio of 0.25 that is 25% of the data will be for testing and 75% will be for training. Here I am going to give different alpha values that is 0 0.1, 1.0 and 10.0 to reach 
cross validation and check which gives us the best model at the alpha values so we fit the model to x train and y train and we get the alpha value as 10 so let us apply the model rich for alpha 10 and calculate the root mean squared error if you haven't learned about root mean square error please go back to my previous video where i have shared different metrics for different algorithms hope you guys like it now the root mean squared error that we have got here is 0.76 which is not so good because the least the lower the root mean squared value the better the model now let us check the alpha values for the lasso and what we get here is 19.28 so let me quickly fit the values and check the root mean squared error the root mean squared header here is 0.91 which is worse than rich so we can conclude that the lasso here is not so useful for this particular data let us try with lasso loss lasso loss gave us 0, 0.0 as the alpha value so let us let me fit the parameters and the root mean squared error is 0.7621 which is almost equivalent to the range so the best root mean squared error the, le the least root mean squared error that we can get for our model is 0.76 hope you guys like this video please do not forget to subscribe share comment on it thank you also please let me know in the comments if you want me to make a video to install anaconda as some of my friends have been asking for it I would definitely make one for you. Have a great day.